Greetings and welcome back to Cinefus Solar Empire Rebellion, Star Trek Amada 3. So, it's been a little while since I've played Star Trek Amada. The last campaign was the Cardassian Rebellion, where I played as Cardassians with my Federation allies and fought against uh, the Dominion. Now, as we have seen in that campaign, the Cardassians are actually quite powerful. Their ships are very sturdy and quite easy to use. And to be honest, the Federation was quite outgunned during that campaign. But actually, for this playthrough, I will be playing as a Federation. I haven't played yet with them since the last version of Star Trek Armada was released. So I do want to find out if they actually were improved in any way. So uh, we'll be playing the Dominion Wars, which means that... Uh, let's first of all pick a map. We'll be picking this one. It's a rather, rather large map. And the game options will be the same as usual because it works. And so, we'll be Federation, we will have some Klingon allies, we will have some Romulan allies. And let's first of all put everyone in the same team, and one hard. And we will be playing, obviously, against the Cardassians slash Dominion. And I was thinking, how many shall we fight against now? Uh, 3 versus 3. Could already be quite challenging, but I think I'll just spice things up and do a 3 versus 4. Now, uh, the reason is that if we do manage to take out one of the uh, factions early on, at least it won't get too easy. We'll still have to fight quite fiercely to uh, destroy all the other ones, but yeah, things could go absolutely horribly wrong. <laughs> I think the chances are pretty big that it will. But we'll have to find out. Uh, so we got that. Yeah, three versus four. But uh, one thing we do have to remember is that we will be able to get multiple packs. So I'll get a pact with the Klingons and the Romulans, while the Cardassians will only be able to get a pact with other Cardassians. So we will get a little bit of a bonus from that. I'm not sure if it's going to be enough to uh, balance the scales, but we'll see. So hopefully everything is properly set up and let's start the game. And I did preload the map, so it loaded pretty quickly. Uh, Alright, there's our allies. Over here, normally, our uh, Dominion enemies should be. And I guess one of the issues is that I am quite in the middle of the map. But we'll have to see how much in the middle that we are, because the map isn't... The map is somewhat linear. Uh, actually, I should be building some stuff. So, let us build... I'm going to start off with a Jupiter station to uh, increase my economy research and let's also build an ambassador let's build a few sabers and a colony ship all right so yeah the map is a little bit linear in a way that uh, there's not going to be that many planets but a lot of connections so uh, there will be a lot of opportunity to get some you know, some choke points some bottlenecks going to try and defend give the word planetary system detected We'll see more of it once uh, all of this gets explored. The Klingon Empire recognizes your prowess. So we get the houses to rest. As you can see, we got uh, four packs with the Klingons, four packs with the Romulans. They got the same uh, eight packs that they can do with uh, the other two factions, but the Cardassians can only do the same packs with each other. So, yeah, I don't know. Give the word. Standing by. Crew standing by. Prepare the docking bays. And what's this cruiser? Just some maquis. Shouldn't be too much of an issue. Alright, we got our ambassador. That's finished. We got plenty of ships. I'm gonna send them. Uh, let's see, let's make a Danube squadron. Uh, let's send them over there. And I'm also gonna need a skill. We're going to be going with Extend Warp Field because it is the most useful skill, in my opinion. And let's maybe reinforce shields. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And do we get... No, I'm not going to buy a level. It's too expensive. We're also in a dead-end world. So we will be able to try and fortify everything as much as possible. Prepare the colonists. 
So I'm probably going to be building big star bases everywhere. So we got our colony ship, that's good. Uh, maybe I should do some research, that'd be great. Let us get some extra titanium extraction, interstellar commerce. I think I will be building some commerce stations. I won't have the time, the luxury, to wait until I can build uh, star bases. So what else do we need? Uh, maybe a few more Saber class, uh, because we will need to fight off these ones as well. Three heavy raiders, uh, who probably... Yeah, these guys do have quite a bit of hit points. So I'm probably going to be losing maybe a few sabers during that fight. This one isn't too bad. Uh, a few light raiders, one cruiser back here. Wait a minute, where is he? This guy. And unfortunately, I'm playing with the Federation and we have noticed earlier in some of the earlier campaigns that the FPS drop while playing the Federation somehow is very big. Is this loud? I think it is loud. Uh, let's just lower the uh, sound effects a little bit. Alright. Planetary system detected. Okay, let's see. How are my ships doing? Shit, one of these servers is about to die. I should have paid a little more attention. It's probably way too late. Uh, but we should have a few new ones Standing back by. here. Let's send them into the fight. Yeah, yeah one saber dead. Uh, so, we got an asteroid here. We got a planetoid here. We can uh, colonize all of that. We got this. We got something back here. We also, ooh, Alpha Centauri. Yeah, so we'll be going for that soon-ish, once we are able to. Alright, research complete. Let's get another level of this. Get more Tritanium. I uh, should be building more things, but I don't want to spend my uh, resources too much on buildings that I don't really need yet. So I'm probably going to be researching stuff uh, not too deep, but more like wide. Uh, right, we also have commerce, but there's no point in building a commerce station yet, since I don't have any... Shit, i lose another saber. That doesn't happen often, usually I always manage to save all my sabers, but oh well, it is what it is. It's just a saber after all. Let's build a few new ones. We could also get some uh, saber research going. I uh, will be building a... Uh, a res research station back here as well. Research complete. Yeah, he got popped. Standing by. Standing by. We're about to pop this cruiser, that's good. Standing by. Change heading. And I think I will get, let's see. Standing by. This is a buff for the saber. I think this is, no, this is from Miranda. I'm gonna get this buff for the saber. Maybe it's useful, maybe not. I don't know. Uh, I don't need this yet. Uh, commerce. Yeah, well, we don't exactly have that much money to spend on the research. Awaiting orders. Change heading. Let's try and save this guy. Oh, actually, they're all dead. Almost. All right, let's get our colony ship up there and colonize quickly. Give the word. I've still got all these stupid little Danubes, but they should be degenerating. So I'm going to get all the other ships over there. Prepare the colonists. Oh. Give the word. All crews stand ready. Now the next fight is going to be a lot more difficult because uh, there's going to be a lot bigger ships down there. So we will need some more firepower. So we will require more logistical and maybe some more command. I could push out another Research ambassador maybe, complete. although I don't really have the money for it. Squadron reporting, Captain. Colonization was uh, there we go. Let us build yes, these mining bases. Luckily I do have one extra dilithium, which is wonderful. So 
uh, let us also try and save some money. We're losing 2.4 per second from this place, which is not good. So let's build up some infrastructure to compensate. I'm also going to be setting this as my rendezvous point. Actually, I guess I should put it all the way over there. Give the word. Steady as she goes. So yeah, I don't know how this will go. Empire ranking were first because I guess we colonized before the AI did. I guess that's something, but it's not much. Prep all systems. Okay, we got a lot more. Yeah, we're gonna need to look into getting Station some cruisers. Uh, now what about packs? We can't get any packs yet. We will need... Uh, what is it? Yeah, some diplomacy. So we'll be going for the Surak refit so that we can get a diplomacy, diplomacy ship. I'm not gonna go for this yet. There's no point. Uh, what else do I need? Miranda class. Now, thing is, I usually always build sabers instead of Mirandas. I'm not entirely sure which one is better. Uh, the Miranda requires one less supply, also uh, quite a bit less resources, but I think that the saber, when you look at the phaser damage and the photon torpedo damage, it is uh, a little bit higher. And also a bit more hull, a bit more armor, so they are a little more sturdy. So, I don't know. Usually I stick with savers to try and save a little bit of money from not having to upgrade the Mirandas. So let's get a few, well, one more saber, I guess. Okay, what's next? Yeah, I wanted one command point. I'm gonna need a bit more money for that. Oh yeah, should also be looking at trade. I could be building a trade station around here if I have Standing enough by. money. I don't. Awaiting orders. Let's see, so how many ships would I have? We got one, two, three, four sabers. Give the word. Five sabers. Six sabers versus uh, three heavy raiders. I'm not sure if that's going to end up well. But we might as well try. But what resources? Uh, three asteroids. We will need those asteroids. So we don't really have much of a choice. We'll have to attack Mission rather complete. quickly. Okay, so let's put down... Crap, we're out of the lithium. Okay, screw the trading post. We're gonna have to Give the word. colonize that Give system soon-ish. So I'm gonna just get a few more extra ships. A bunch more sabers. And I might try and engage. Now one of my ships is in very bad state, but that's alright. Let's see, what's the cost of a saber? 380. Yeah, I should really try and not get them killed. Fire when ready. Standing by. Awaiting orders. Standing by. Maybe we can do some hit and run. Uh, get one of these guys to die before we do. Enemy engaged. Change heading. Okay, so uh, we got a little bit of money. Let's take a look at research. We really need another command point, but I don't even have enough money for uh, to build another ambassador. So uh, we could get some upgrades down here to boost our firepower or max shields, hell points. Let's boost our firepower. Let's see, how good are we doing? He is... Not even close to being dead. Then again, he did lose his shield, so... I sort of have to adapt once again, because I have been playing... Uh, Battlestar Galactica, Fall of Global. And none of the ships there have shields, so... Yeah, okay, it, it's, it's going okay. I guess the evasive maneuvers is really helping those sabers. I never actually bothered getting it. Uh, let's build a few more and that'll have to be enough for my initial fleet. We got some raiders here. What do we got here? Interceptor frigate, frigate, frigate. Okay, well that should be enough. 
Give the word. Steady as she goes. One of them has popped. Okay, that's good. Let's focus everything on this guy. Okay, this is all maxed. I'm gonna need another... Uh, let's actually take a look at my logistical slots. I still got nine left. I might still have some upgrades. Let's see. No, I don't. So, I could build one more uh, Jupiter station. And we're gonna need the other slot for the trading posts. Are we doing the sabers are actually doing pretty well? They seem to be staying alive a lot better. Let's see, how often can they do this? Uh, cooldown 80 seconds, duration 30. That's not too bad. They seem to have plenty of antimatter to do it quite often, but one of our ships isn't in good shape. I'm gonna withdraw it before it's too late. As all resources count. Oh yeah, and in the meantime, we do have a nice look at what the galaxy, or well, not the galaxy, the planetary system looks like. So as I mentioned, there's going to be a lot of uh, choke points because there's not a lot of uh, jump lanes in between all these systems. So we'll probably have to fight for every system. <laughs> uh, do we have any Dominion yet? Let's see. I guess we... No, we haven't found them yet. They gotta be around here somewhere. Uh, we'll stumble onto them eventually. But for now, we're still in the colonization phase. Which is quite important, because I do need to colonize a lot of stuff, so that I have enough resources to actually fight back. Alright, I'm actually gonna send my colony ship in. It's probably gonna survive, and the... I don't think these guys can bomb. No, they can't bomb. So we should be good. Afterwards, I'm gonna go straight towards Alpha Centauri, I think, because... Well, I gotta go this way to try and take over as much uh, planets from Station. what could possibly become uh, Dominion lands. So I certainly want Alpha Centauri. There's still a lot of stuff that has to be discovered. Could I build a few more Novas? Uh, 300 credits, that's a little too much. Prepare the colonists. Helm, new heading. Normally this colony ship should be safe. Alright, so... Let's get some trade going. Got one trading post down there. I could build one in Deneb once I get the money. I could sell a little bit of metal. Planetary system detected. Yeah, I gotta wait for a daily team. Alright, those guys are dead. Awaiting orders. Colonization. We'll successful. be going for Alpha Centauri. There's also a nebula down here, so I guess that'll be pretty much one of the boundaries, maybe, depending on what the, the what is this? Klingon or Romulan? These are the Klingons, these are the Romulans. Uh, there's oh wait a minute. That's odd. Uh, we got one Cardassian down here. That's odd. I was expecting, because of the way I set up all the uh, factions, that all the uh, Cardassians would have been on this side. That's odd. Oh well, it is what it is. Uh, we're still outnumbered, so it's not like it's gonna make things any easier. Okay, let's build a few more... Let's start with this one. Did I build a trading post here? I don't think I did. I didn't have the money, and I just spent a bunch on those. Standing by. Altering course. Change heading. Let's see, how's my money? Uh, we need to get an upgrade on Talar to get some extra money. Now, once again, I'm out of money, so I can't build a trading post yet. Standing by. Station complete. Alright, so let's go towards Planetary Alpha Centauri. Actually, uh, let's take a quick look if there are any specific planets that I would like. 
with a lot of resources. Uh, we're about to check this one. Station complete. Well, Romulus doesn't exactly look like it should. <laughs> oh, there we go. Soria. Yeah. Well, there is uh, quite a bit of resources here uh, for asteroids. That's not too bad. So I might want to go there as well. Vega doesn't have much. Tenobula has two asteroids. Uh, so yeah, I guess we might move on to Soria after that. To maximize the amount of resources I get from colonizing. Uh, let's jump my fleet to Alpha Centauri. Altering course. Prepare the colonists. And let's set my rendezvous point to Telar. So we had one trading post, now let's build one in Deneb. I might have enough, okay, there we go. Standing and let's see by. how this goes. Uh, there's only a few small ships here, I think. Two interceptors and a bunch of small frigates. So we should be totally fine, normally. We got plenty of ships, so that shouldn't be too much of an issue. Planetary system detected. And there we got the orange Cardassians slash Dominion. I guess eventually we'll find out which one it is. Hmm. I guess we'll have to try and take out purple sooner rather than later to make sure that we stand a chance. Otherwise we might get overwhelmed by four uh, hard mode Cardassians. Station All right, complete. we got enough money for another trading post down here, but not enough dilithium. So let's wait a little while. We're almost there. Yeah, we're making some money. I'm gonna have to get some more planetary upgrades as well. Planetary system detected. In the meantime, let's take a look at the statistics. Uh, Empire ranking, terrible. Military, terrible. Economy, great. Okay, well, that's something, I guess. Especially considering the fact that all these guys get a bonus to, draw, to all their economy stuff, so... Uh, but it's not gonna last. Alright, we should be able to get some research here. I'm gonna wait until I get 100 dilithium to get the extra dilithium extraction. Oh, crap. No, 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 no pirates. Um, not sent them after purple. Crap, I'm gonna have to waste money on this. I don't have enough. It might be enough. It might also not be enough. I don't know. In the meantime, we're still fighting down here. But we've almost uh, cleared out the whole place, so I'm gonna send in my colony ship. And trade is going pretty well. We're still waiting for the trading post at Delor to be finished. Uh, what else do we need? Oh yeah, there we go. More dilithium extraction. That's wonderful. Station uh, we will need tier 2 colonization for Soria. Uh, so we will need yet another civilian research base. We only have one logistical slot left here, so that's not gonna work. Let's build one in Deneb. Right. Yellow alert. Activate it. Now what? Planetary system detected. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. Um Steady. Can these guys bomb? I think they can. Crap. I gotta withdraw. I don't have enough firepower to take down those battle cruisers. That's four of them. That's a little bit too much. Let's also withdraw our uh, colony ship. Alright, so we will need more ships. I'm gonna need uh, an extra ambassador, so I'm gonna have to get 
an extra command point. Oh, he actually did. Alright, well that's maybe not good. Do we fight? No, that's, it's five now. That's a little much. This one's damaged, but that's about the only one. I'm not sure if I can actually fight off these guys. I could try. Uh, let's try. So yeah, that, that wasn't exactly planned. <laughs> uh, it's very possible this will go horribly wrong. I could perhaps build some... No, I don't have any of this researched yet. Where are they going anyway? Let's see, this one... Yeah, let's focus on this one. He is damaged. I'm pretty sure that I might be losing too many sabers in this battle. Planet but you never know. Detected. Maybe some of them will be distracted to bomb the planets, I don't know. Yeah, one saber is about to go down. It's probably way too late to jump it out. Give the word. Still, if we could take down one of them, I'd be glad. I'm gonna be saving some money until we get another ambassador. That'll make it a lot easier to actually clear out this place. This one is getting beaten up. Let's redraw it. This isn't gonna work, is it? I need more ships. Yeah, let's withdraw everything. Helm, bring us about. In the meantime, yeah, we gotta get up to three thousand points to build another ambassador. Well, three thousand credits. Uh, if we save it for a little while, we might be able to have enough. Uh, we're getting six point one from trade, which is not bad. Uh, they're probably gonna try and bomb Alpha Centauri, which is. Well, not fine, but it is what it is. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna lose another saber. I'm gonna be glad if I at least have about five left by the time I get back to Teller. In the meantime, we also have a... F oh shit, they're actually jumping all the way back here. That's, that's even worse. Where are they going? If they're just passing through, I'm totally fine with it, but... They seem to be just passing through. Uh, you know what? Oh crap, I don't have much of a choice, do I? Now that I engage them, I can't exactly outrun them. So let's just wait until we get another ambassador. It shouldn't take that long. Coordinates. Yeah, that wasn't good. If it wasn't for these stupid marauders, we would have been able to take Alpha Centauri. Actually, we did take Alpha Centauri, so I could just build up some stuff. Because they seem to be focused on something else. And of course, I did spend a bunch of credits that I should have kept. But they are moving someplace else, so maybe they're gonna leave me alone. Or not. Hmm, maybe not. Damn it. Oh well. So what do we got left? Standing by. Steady as she goes. Change heading. We might also need a bunch of uh, fortifications, but I'm gonna need some research for that as well. Let's see. Um, orbital command. Uh, soul type is one bit. Strike raft. Yeah, that's the one I need. Uh, it's actually quite cheap to research, so let's do that. I still got enough money to build the ambassador. There we go. Okay, so what are they doing? They seem to be just targeting Research. my construction vessel. Hmm. Alright, anyway, that's gonna be it for this first episode. So, yeah, uh, it's, it's a pretty big map, bigger than the one I used before. So, yeah, and for enemy heart Cardassians. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is probably going to be quite a bloody fight. Anyway, thank you very much for watching and see you next time.